Hey guys, today I'm just gonna give you my two cents on uh, working smart or working hard because my opinion is that you should work hard and not smart or not so much smart. And I know that um, a lot of you guys will disagree to that and say, no, you need, you know, you, you will burn out and you cannot work so hard and you really need to like work as smart as possible. The problem with that is that when you're starting out, you're not smart. Where do you get your smarts from? If you are smart, like I could put up a shop quickly and I could find a winning offer and I could sell products online quickly because I've done it so many times now I have the skills to do it however when you start you don't have that so I, I can work maybe one tenth of the hours and I will have a better outcome than you would have when you're just starting just because I've done it so 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 many times so now I can work smart because I know the smart way However, when you're just starting out, you're, you don't know how, how things are done. You don't know how to create great Facebook ads. You don't know how to, how to create a shop that actually sells, how to write copy that's persuasive. You don't know how to put together the right offer, how to find suppliers, right? But if you want to work smart, look, I have, a, I have a sourcing company here in China. I have a whole team that can do my sourcing. That's very smart, right? We already have winning templates that we used for our stores. So. I can leverage that, that's very smart, right? That's not the hard work. However, when you're just starting out, you need to work hard. There's no way around that. Obviously, you wanna work as smart as possible. The problem is you just don't have the skill set yet. But to acquire the skill set, you have to work really, really hard. Think about Mike Tyson or Conor McGregor or any of the big fighters. Like, do you think they just sat there and was like, hmm, I can just actually outsmart the guy. So maybe when he makes this move, I'm gonna distract him and then I'm gonna hit him in the face. So I'm gonna do something that's really smart, right? No, they're not doing that. They're working their ass off every day. They're getting their, their, their nose beat in every day. They're practicing, they're training, they're training their mind, they're training their body, they're, they're, they're taking care of what they eat. It's a, because they wanna, they wanna be winning and they wanna be at the level where most people can't get to. And that's exactly where you want to, to be. You want to be at a level where most people can't get to. You wanna be able to quit your job, you wanna be able to, to profit from e-commerce products, whether you, you own a business already or whether you're just starting, you just wanna make that work. And by doing that, you're just the, the half percent, maybe maybe 0.1% of person or people on the planet that actually strive for that. The same like the fighters do, the same like the like Michael Phelps stuff, the same that anyone who wanna ex achieve extraordinary results. Obviously, you wanna train as smart as possible, but you need to develop the skill set necessary first. And that is why you need to work hard before you can work smart. And the whole thing of, you know, work as smart as possible, the 80-20 rule, all of that stuff, like it's great and obviously you should use that and obviously you should take care of the 20% of things that give you 80% of the results. But how do you know what, what are the 20%? If you're just starting out, you have no clue what you need to focus on. So how do you determine that? It's not that easy, it's not that black and white. You don't know what to focus on when you're just starting out. I don't know what to focus on to make a hundred million dollars, right? Because I haven't done that. I'm, I'm working hard towards that goal. So I don't know what to do it. So I could sit here all day long and think about it. What would be the smartest way to get there? And obviously that's something you need to do once in a while. However, the majority of time, 99.999% of the time, I spend busting my ass getting there because that's what's required. You need to put the hard work in. So I encourage you to do that. I encourage the hustle. You will not burn out as soon as you will see progress. And if you have some more time in the day, if you have any more time in the day that you're not spending working on your goal, but maybe your goal isn't big enough. Maybe it doesn't, maybe it's not exciting enough to you. Like if you, th if you look at Arnold Schwarzenegger, uh, or Arnold Schwarzenegger, that's how she's actually pronouncing it in German. Anyway, just, just being, just being uh, smart here. Uh, that guy gave a speech and he's like, look, when I went to school, I did a job, and I became the world's biggest bodybuilder in the world. How did he do that? He didn't do that by thinking about it and being smart about it and thinking about, okay, what's the best technique I can use to work out so that I'm bigger than anyone else who puts out five or six hours of workout a day in. Like, what's he got to do? He's got to put that extra time in and do it smart, right? So what he, he gave his speech once and he said, look, if you have any more time in your day, like there's time, you need to take that time and put it into the things that you actually want to do. And he said, look, if, if, if you say, well, then I only have six hours of sleep, that's not enough for me, then just sleep faster. 
right? That's kind of that's that was kind of his mentality. It didn't kill him. It made it, it made him one of the, the well most well known people in the world. It gave him the roles and in, in, as an actor, and it did so you know, well for him, but he needed to put the time and he needed to put the hustle in and he needed to put the hours in when he didn't want to. He needed to work really hard before he was able to work smart, okay? And it's the same for you on any level, you need to work hard. And working hard and busting your ass shouldn't be frowned upon. And I know in, in on today's videos, you, all, you see this, you know, don't burn out and like all this crap. If you wanna achieve extraordinary results, you have to put an extraordinary efforts and if you don't know how to motivate yourself uh, i have another video coming that's actually coming out tomorrow uh, where i touch on that uh, so make sure, to, sure that you subscribe to this channel make sure that you follow this and hit the notification bell because if not you will not be notified by youtube um, to see that video so i look forward to see you there leave me a comment below what you think about this attitude uh, do you think i'm just crazy or do you think that actually makes sense what i'm saying let me know either way in the comments and i look forward to chat with you there uh see you in a couple of minutes in that web class i have in the description so that's something you definitely need to watch so you can work a little bit smarter and then you put a lot of hard work into execute so make sure you watch that i'll see you then a couple of minutes and uh, have a good day cheers